Today I want to share with you a tool that will help you create outlines for your articles and blog posts that will not only save you time, but will give you the best chance of ranking on Google and other search engines. The tool is called Phrase and they've recently made a really big update to their outline builder and it incorporates AI into it. If you're not familiar with Phrase, it's a tool that helps you to plan, write and optimize your articles for ranking on search engines. So here we are in Phrase. I've got this set up so that we're gonna be writing an article about long tail keywords. Um, if we go over to the right hand side, these are all the different sections of Phrase that you can use to uh, plan and write your article. We're actually in the outline section at the moment. And we've got three different options now for creating an outline. Um, there's a select headings from search results. There's the new section, which is generate heading ideas with AI. Or if you've already know the different headings that you're having your outline, you can cut and paste them in here. So let's have a look at these first two sections. So we'll start with select headings from search results. This is what phrase has uh, traditionally looked like. And what this is doing is it's looking at the top 20 results um, on, on Google and looking at all of their different uh, H2, H3 headings. Now, if you can imagine, this is gonna save you a lot of time than scrolling through Google search results themselves. because so it's got them all here. And then the idea is you can go through this and look at the different headings and choose ones that you like for your particular article. So you might say, right, I want to talk about what are long tail keywords. Um, let's have a look along here. Um, why are keywords important? So that's from a different uh, website. That one's from SEM Rush. And let's have a look at what Neil Patel's talking about. He's saying, um, how to research your different keywords, and we'll maybe choose one more, um, how to find long tail keywords, which is from Search Engine Journal. So this will give us a, a nice starting point. You could actually have, uh, you know, 10 or 15 different headings. And these are all H2s. You can change these by just clicking on them and say changing it to uh, an H3 and then click in here. Um, you can also just click and drag. So if you wanted to change that back to an H2, just click and drag it back and then it goes to an H2. Um, if you click and drag to the right, it will go down to an H3 or, or an H4. So that's the uh, traditional way of creating a outline. So let's just clear that and go back to what the latest update in phrase is, which is generate headings, heading ideas with AI. Then we just wait a few moments for phrase to generate its outline. So you can see now it's saved you quite a bit of time um, by coming up with an outline here, which you can use straight off the bat. Or what I would do is actually look at this and then and say, right, well, what are the bits that I don't like, which you can then just delete them here. So um, let's look at this in a bit more detail. That all looks okay. But say we didn't, um, we didn't want this section at the end incorporating long tail keywords, we, ju we just delete it here. Easy, easy peasy. Um, but if you're thinking, well, there are some extra things I want to add in, you can click on this part, explore headings, and then we're back to here. Um, the top 20 results, and we can just check that there aren't any things that have been missed off. We've still got our AI generated um, outline here, but let's just say we wanted to add in how to identify long tail keywords. Click on that, adds it to the bottom, but maybe we want it to be up, something just click and drag that up, and then maybe we'll add uh, yeah, running a gap analysis, uh, put that in there. Now, if there are any sections that you think are missing that you want to add in, you can just click on this, add a custom header. So say you wanted to add uh, an FAQ section, you can just 
add that in as an H2. And then any questions in there, let's say, what is the definition of a long tail keyword? We'll maybe add that as an H3. And then you've got a nice article um, outline here. Now, once you're happy and you're, you think that you've finished, you can click on Save Outline. Now that brings us back to this page, which is actually the content brief page here. And then we can click on paste and that will take it out of your outline builder here and actually over into your content brief. Now, once it's in here, you can copy and paste that and send that off to your writer if you're having somebody else to actually write your articles for you. Or if you're writing them yourself, you can actually start actually writing them within phrase here, or you can copy and paste this brief into a Word document or Google Docs, whatever you're working in. So then you've got a really great um, starting point for writing your article. Well, I hope you found that information useful. There'll be a link to phrase in the description below this video. If you've got any questions, then please just leave me a comment and I'll get back to you.